Today we're going to show you how we transformed sushi soy sauce packets into door handles. As we're taking you through the full recycling process, the first thing we need to do is turn the packets into a workable material. So we begin by turning on our compact Zephyr Brothers benchtop shredder so we can granulate the plastic packaging into smaller flakes. We feed the soy fish into the hopper where they're chopped down into smaller pieces, essentially creating our new recycled raw material ready to go for the next stage of the transformation process. It's worth mentioning that we're working with single use soy packaging today because they're too small to be recycled by in industrial facilities, so can't go in curbside recycling bins. Here's our shredded material. If needed, we can run this through the shredder a second time to reduce the size further. Throughout the process, we're sure to collect and clean up any cheeky plastic flakes that manage to escape our container. Now that our material is ready to go, we move on to the fun part. We've preheated our Zephyr Brothers benchtop extruder and have popped some of the granulate into the hopper. As we crank the handle, we're conveying the material through the barrel where the plastic is melted down. Here you can see the hot plastic coming out of the nozzle. As the fish base and lid are both LDPE, we're using all of the material together, allowing them to blend. As our final product will be 100% recycled LDPE, it will also be recyclable again at end of life. Next, we set up our product mold. Our doorknob mold uses an interchangeable face plate. We place this into the mold before assembling the remainder of the parts. The doorknob we're creating today can be used as a handle or a coat hook. We screw the product mold onto the machine nozzle and then crank the handle to squish all of that molten plastic into the mold. It goes without saying that when we're heating plastic, it's critical that we know what kind of material we're working with and how to work with it safely. Once we've filled the mold, it's unscrewed and opened up to reveal the product inside. At this stage, we can do any post-production tidy up, removing the sprue or any flashing if required. All offcuts are recovered so that they can be returned to the material cycle. Thanks for watching and to find out more about our small scale recycling machines head to plastic.org.au